I would hope that we're sort of friendly and non-precious. I mean, you go into some art galleries and it's a wipe your feet on the mat experience, you know, and then ring the doorbell. That's absolutely the very thing that I would resist. We aim to be welcoming and we aim to take a non-precious approach to art. The gallery was founded in 1897, um, thanks to the generosity of a local lady called Arabella Roxburgh, uh, opened its doors three years later. Um, and from that moment onwards, the collection has been free uh, to everybody, and it's still free today. In the permanent collection, we hold about 12,000 items, which are in constant rotation. We have works from such a wide scope of people and such wide techniques. It's just a really exciting place to come and see things. We have about five exhibitions, main exhibitions, visiting the gallery a year and most people say it's so nice to be able to see a small gallery with a big variety of paintings in it. It's very good that we have changing exhibitions regularly. There's the Friends of the Victoria Art Gallery is a very active group and we have a lot of events accompanying the exhibitions. There's quite a lot going on. I would hope that visitors can expect to see some great art in relaxed surroundings, but also have a bit of fun. We've got so many activities for people of all ages. You know, art is for everybody, and the Victoria Art Gallery is for everybody as well.